From here we head back towards Dalkeith, and the other side of town is Melville Castle. The castle was rescued from a period of uncertainty by the Hay Family Trust in 1993 and reopened as a four-star hotel some ten years later, after a three million pound refurbishment in June 2003. During restoration and apparition, featureless but unmistakably female was seen to drift through a wall, which upon further inspection was an old doorway. It was opened up and now serves as the entrance to the Arniston Room from the library, approached via a long, well-surfaced private drive. The castle was built in 1786 by James Playfair, built for Viscount Melville, a great man who at 24 was Solicitor General for Scotland, a Member of Parliament, later becoming Home Secretary and during the French Civil War Minister for War. He was also Lord of the Admiralty. Melville was visited by King George IV during his visit of 1828. In 1842, a young 23-year-old Queen Victoria also visited the castle. However, royal associations go back to Mary Queen of Scots, who used the earlier castle here as a hunting lodge and visited frequently with her secretary, David Rizzio, who took an apartment in the castle. A Spanish chestnut tree was planted in the grounds at that time that can still be seen today, some 450 years later.